Hello guys, Amazon just reported earnings and I've just finished to read the report and as an Amazon shareholder I'm uh, really happy. Uh, in this video I will share with you the key things I liked about this report and I will talk about Amazon company and uh, their fair value what I'm hoping in the future as an Amazon shareholder. So let's tune in. So basically Amazon have a really good uh, quarter um, they grew their revenue in uh, all their uh, key uh, things their uh, e-commerce their AWS their cloud business uh, their advertising grow as well which was really good and even though their revenue grow above 10% it was 11% yes quarter on quarter comparison uh, their net income was really good as well it was not one of the best but it's really good to see their net income positive so Amazon is starting to focus on making money being lucrative and uh, that's uh, a turn on their strategy and I really liked it as a shareholder so in the future I want Amazon continue to grow continue to invest in their key segments and continue to, and starting to making money uh, so we can see what their margins are so uh, if you look into the news um, Amazon had the positive earnings their revenue grow 11% their Amazon web service and advertising um, revenue was above the estimate uh, this is a really good report guys and um, Amazon is up seven and a half percent which is really good um, in my opinion Amazon is one of it's really difficult to understand the company so um, so look into Amazon you look into a 300 PE 50 forward PE it's really high but you have to understand that Amazon is not uh, trying to be profitable or maximizing their gains they are they are still trying to grow, grow, invest a lot to grow and uh, that's why they have no earnings. In the last year they have been having negative earnings but as an Amazon shareholder and as an Amazon shareholder I'm uh, hoping that they can start to to be lucrative again and uh, looking into it so that's why it's really difficult and most investors don't understand uh, Amazon. Uh, but when I look into it, Amazon it's the company in my portfolio. I, I'm a huge believer in this company and in this investment. And if you look into the companies I have in my portfolio, Amazon it's one of the the companies that uh, it's trading around fair value. But I have a high percentage of my portfolio in Amazon. And uh, if you look into our score and qual our quality score, it's not even that high, 49. Um, between uh, zero and 100, it's a median, uh, median score. But in my opinion, you 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 don't you don't, you shouldn't look into the PE of Amazon and into their fundamentals. Looking into it, I just I really like their revenue growth. They are growing a lot. Their gross margins are good, but their net margins are almost zero, around one percent. And in my opinion, if you think Amazon will have 1% margins in the future, you are really, really wrong. They can have really high margins, not high margins as like a tech company, but for e-commerce, they can have 10, 15% margins in my opinion. And that's why I'm hoping in the future they can starting to be really profitable as they scale back some investments. Maybe I don't know what will happen in the future and that's why Amazon it's a company in my opinion that is trading around fair value and uh, but they have a really good moat maybe it's still a good opportunity uh, so Amazon it's one of that companies we, that have a really wide moat who, who doesn't uh, have an Amazon account or who doesn't use one of their products so, and uh, bear in mind even though you look into Amazon as an e-commerce company they have AWS which basically if you look into AWS only, you'll uh, value it uh, maybe to 
500 billion? I don't know. If you look into AWS and their advertising business, the, that two business, it's maybe worth 1 trillion. And the Amazon is valued now at 1.2 trillion. So it might be still a good opportunity. I've talked about that in the Amazon uh, uh, stock analysis video I have in my, uh, my YouTube channel. So if you want to look into in more depth, you should look into that video. So basically Amazon, it's a really good company, wide moat, growing a lot. They will have good margins in the future, I hope. They have a really low debt. They can pay their long-term debt with their cash in hand, basically. They don't have really good return on invested capital or return in equity, which are things I really like, but the, the situation Amazon is, is they are still in growing, they are still in growing phase. So it's normal to not have a high return on invested capital, but I'm, I'm hoping that in one, two, three years, maybe they will have a really high return on invested capital. They have in free cash flow positive wide mode, but they are not returning capital to the shareholders. That's one thing I don't like in the company, but that's what it is. They are still growing that, uh, of course, they are not returning capital because they are focusing on their growth. But looking into that, I'm not talking about valuation, but in my opinion, their fair value of Amazon is around $130. That's the value I'm um, good buying Amazon. but. They were trading around that that value, but now the stock is up. I don't know a lot. I think the stock is up seven and a half percent, trading at around one thirty eight. But I do really have a, a full position on Amazon already, so I'm not buying anymore for now unless they they are trading at a better valuation. So I'm really bullish on this company. I do believe in the next few months next year they will improve a lot their fundamentals and uh, I'm betting on that so I do really like the company is a company I'm hoping to to hold for the next five years ten years maybe so I do believe it's still a, a good company at the moment it's old for me I'm not buying more it I I have a, already a full position on Amazon and um, that's my opinion. I do really like the company. They have to get better. And uh, this last earnings report is the it's proof that they are getting better. They are still growing a lot. They are returning to profitability. So that's good things. I and I'm hoping the in one or two years you look into Amazon and you will say it's a really good company with good fundamentals. So I'm betting on that and that's my opinion guys. I hope you find this video hopeful and if you like it, please subscribe. Bye guys.